Hello, you all. You already know what we about to get into. We finna get into these messages and see what our element would like us to know at this time. And what our Elohim like us to know at this time. We got the sun. And then we have the two of pentacles. Six of wands. Eight of swords and the ace of pentacles with the four of cups at the bottom. So some type, some type of truth is being illuminated here. Somebody was trying to get some sort of superficial victory here with juggling somebody. Somebody felt like they were skilled at whatever this was. But something could be happening. With somebody's superficial connection here. Yeah, somebody could be in regret. Somebody thought they were skilled and sweet at doing what they was doing. But now somebody is in the four of cups. Disappointed. Dissatisfied. And discontent. This person fears how somebody goes within. And this King of Swords energy, they fear how somebody goes within. They follow their inner guidance. And this, somebody fears this. Yeah, because this man. This man feared us because this man is karmic now. We got the devil. This man fears this because this man is karmic. This man has cruel intentions. But this man fears somebody's knowledge, the knowledge that somebody has. So they could run away from this person or... Yeah, this, this person could have walked away from this person or left this person. This person could have been a part of some, some some type of plan against this person here. And this person who goes within and knows about it, they know. They know about what somebody was doing. Somebody accepted some sort of challenge and came up with a bright idea here to try to cause some type of chaos or try to get into some, get somebody into some type of fight or competition. And this person knows about it. And this man feared this person's um, inner knowing. Because this person, inner knowing, knows that this man is the enemy. They know they're karmic. And it be scaring this man because this man, this uh person know. They be knowing. What the heck going on? So somebody should. Because they was, they was dealing with the enemy. And then they also like, well, they also like kind of like want to walk away or fear it because they can't manipulate you with the magician. 
They can't manipulate you. This, per this person could have been discussing something or teaming up with other people to do something towards you. This person was with the enemy for real and they was going against you. Or they did this in the past and you know about it. I'm telling you, they shook about it. they shook about you knowing that, but they also shook because they can't, you know, they can't manipulate you with this magician. This person could like want to work with you, team up with you, take action towards you and reconcile but it just still be like man it's, this person been trying to manifest this you could have left this person out of the cold you call judgment on this person but this person want to take a leap of faith to some sort of partnership but you kind of got them like I don't know This person tried to hide some sort of truth from you about who they was partnering up with, who they was giving love to, who they were sleeping with. Yeah, some type of, the veil has been lifted up, some type of truth. They're trying to hide whatever this is. Yeah, this was some type of betrayal here, four of wands to the ten of swords. This person, this person, this person could just be feared that they can't stab your ass in the back. Yeah, you guarded towards this person. You guarded towards this person because this person got other stuff going on. And it just really even shows within this King of Swords card because look at them. Yeah, this person may, you know, be thinking about having you like this. But look, there's somebody in the window here. This man just mad because he can't finesse. It takes a finesse. <laughs> this person want to finesse you. And they mad they can't finesse you. That's it. I'm telling you, this person, like, they want you to self-sabotage. They want you to self-sabotage. That's the only way that they're going to get you. They want you to self-sabotage. They want to try to put it on like, you know, they are built with you. You know, they making a decision to commit to you. Eight of Pentacles. It's an illusion. Seven of Cups. It's an illusion. Yeah. They want thing they want to they want to sell you a dream and they want you to buy it. Buy the dream that I want to sell you. <laughs> a dream of a harmonious balanced relationship. Buy the dream that I want to sell you. Cuz this person want to have success with just, you know, making some sort of offer to you, but then what's what's beyond this fake shit is stress and burdens unhappiness and negativity but this person gonna want this person gonna try to show up as an angel energy as a gentle energy as a loving energy chivalrous even um mm -mm. person could want to hop in their car and head towards you but no we have stress and burdens and then we have the nine of swords it'll just be negativity this person really want to embarrass you is this person weird this person is cruel. This devil energy. They just... Somebody could get off with hurting you. Or disappointing you. That's what they want to do. So somebody is basically like... They don't like that you listen to your inner knowing or your inner guidance. Because they want to disappoint you. Let me stab you in the back. Let me act like it's this and that and then stab you in the back. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Mm. 
Yeah. But you could be like in this Queen of Swords energy, like you really ain't fucking with it. And then this man want to try to sh manipulate you or just show up as the King of Cups, right? This man is curious if he can get this done here. And then all he going to do is breadcrumb you. Tower to the complete happiness, the dream that he tried to sell you. It's going to go fast with the Eight of Wands. <laughs> this person, is, this is somebody who's just like, please let me disappoint you. Let me hurt you. Like, what is wrong with this karmic ass man? This person is salty that you will not let them disappoint you. Okay. Anything else? Yeah, this person's just going to breadcrumb you. That's all they want to do. Tower. They want to cause a tower in your life. Yeah, you've been holding back your energy, your love. You really don't see potential in this person. You look at them like a fool. Um, You could be very nurturing, loving, confident, powerful, beautiful. Yeah. This person just wants some form of control. That's it. Please let me disappoint you. Oh, please. Oh, please. Won't you let me disappoint you? Because <laughs> that's basically what this person is asking for. Please, oh, please. Can I disappoint you, please? The signs between you all... We have Leo, Sag, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, Capricorn, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries, Taurus, Virgo. disappoint you pretty please yeah yo sh see this is what it is yo shine irritate this person demon so they like man they trying to cause a tower <laughs> that is so sad Yeah, this person negative. Do not deal with this person. They just trying to hurt you. Your light irritates this person demons. But at the same time, they into you. Like, you can't deal with nobody like this. <laughs> Your light irritates they demons. At the same time, they into you. Like, mm -mm. yeah, you could be running. You better keep running. Better keep running, run away from this person. They could be into you. Y'all could even have good chemistry, great vibes. But this person also, your light irritates their demons because they in that devil karmic energy. So it's like <laughs> at the same time, they don't fuck with you. <laughs> so you better run. You better run. This person could have been dealing with somebody and they could have got some sort of abortion. Somebody could have been marrying for money. Somebody is under judgment. Or you need to run and abort this, whatever this is that y'all got. Yeah, we have drunk bitch, lustful animalistic sexual desires. This person could like to drink. They have lustful, animalistic, sexual desires. Yeah, you got to abort this. At the top, dodging bullets. Blocking negative, escaping crazy people. Yeah, you got to hit your matrix on this person because they ain't got nothing for you but a dirty offer, for real. They ain't got nothing for you but a dirty offer. 
this person could even uh this person could have got a drunk bitch pregnant too too as well you know dealing with their lustful sexual animalistic desires and stuff yeah this boss daddy they gonna come off like is this stable energy and stuff big dick energy boss energy but mm -mm. they only come in with a dirty offer they just lonely they just lonely this a sneaky bitch <laughs> this man is a sneaky confused bitch that's gonna kiss your ass and then try to hurt you it's like it's weird yeah this a groupie and this man got to play it out way of thinking. He like to play games here. And the games is old. Look at this. It's like, well, this, that's, it's that old Nintendo. Yeah, you might need to block this person. Or you could have blocked this person off your social media before. But we got that crazy bitch back at it again. This person be hating on your happiness. Because they don't like the fact that you're unfazed. And that, you know, you happy and at peace and shit. So they trying to come in and mess with it. I'm telling you. This person trying to force their way on you. They just want to mess with your peace. This, this is a peace disturber. This person just want to mess with your peace. That's all. They ain't got nothing for you. This person um, just could feel neglected by you. This person is toxic, got bad habits, and his bad habits could have led to some sort of undesirable test results. This person could have uh, undesirable test results. This person could have a new baby, even, with a karmic obsessive lover. Or they could have, was planning to have a new baby, but somebody could have got an abortion here. Um, this person could even have an obsessive lover attached to them, or they are the obsessive lover. This person be doing spells. And then we have loser right after that. Mm-mm. This person wants you back with their undesirable test results. Wants you back. But I'm telling you what they want you back for. They need to hurt you. They need to hurt you to feel like a man. <laughs> it's some type of evidence of this person wanting you back or something. This person need to hurt you to feel like a damn man. Okay? Do not deal with this person. This person going through some family issues right now. Somebody got so many bodies, they done lost count. And then this person is stalking and obsessed with you. They want to steal from you emotionally. That's what they need. They need an emotional power up from you. And possibly through a one night stand, they need to sleep with you. So they can take something from you physically or emotionally. So that they can be powered up to deal with a fuck shit. The fuck shit in their life. This person need a boost. This is an energy vampire. They need a boost. This person is willing to do or say anything, okay? To get some sort of justice here. Or this person could even end up facing some sort of illegal issues. Or they could even tell you that, like, I'm going through it, man, you know. Look out for me, please. I need you. <laughs> What's going on with this? Yeah, please keep your distance. Fuck boy alert. This person just want a fake smile in your face. <laughs> That's it, man. And they... Mm -mm. This person could always be partying or dealing with people that's always partying. But this person just want a fake smile in your face. This person just wants you to be hooked on them. And they want to get up in your business. They just want to be in your business. They want you hooked on them. But they sure ain't going to do right by you. 
Yeah, this person always partying, I'm telling you. And this person always hooking up. It's always some type of love triangle or some multiple whatever. I'm about to say multiple choice. Because <laughs> listen, they always messing with a stripper or a dancer. Like, no, keep your distance from this person. They always messing with a stripper or a dancer or somebody with a bad reputation. And then they want to try to come over to you. And no. 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 Don't do it. Girl, don't do it. Yeah, it's a liar. It's a snake. And he like to mess with liars and snakes. So let him have that. Don't let him try to rap her. Look. And he be fake flexing. He a loser. It's a loser. Don't deal with this person. Don't let him wrap around you. This this what he want to do. This snake trying to constrict you. Uh, he a damn bull. This a snake. Don't fall for the snake's tricks. It's a snake, I tell you. It's a snake. They want to hurt you. They need to hurt you. You, you, you they supply. They need to hurt you so that they can feel good about themselves. <laughs> That's a damn shame. They need to hurt you so they can feel good about themselves because they be dealing with bullshit. We got Gemini. You could be a Gemini. They could. Ooh, and it flipped over. We got Gemini. You could be a Gemini. They could be a Gemini. I guess that's it. Ain't nothing else coming out. This could be a Gemini communication. Okay. Ain't nothing else. Last shuffle. Oh, we got another one. We got Capricorn. Gemini, Capricorn, Cancer. Sagittarius. Mm -hmm. I guess that's it, y'all. We got. Hold on, let me see. Because I may not read the bottom. Because it might be just these four. Is it just these four signs? No. Okay, so these could be... This could be you, their sign. This could be this man's sign. This could be your sign. These could be the people that this man deal with sign. We have Gemini, Capricorn, Cancer, Sagittarius, and Pisces. But we're going to pull a grateful heart message because it's always something to be grateful for, to get some information. Just don't deal with this person. They just want to hurt you. Somebody don't like to see you happy. In all your ways, acknowledge him and he shall direct your paths. I will lift my eyes to the hills from whence come my help. My help comes from Yahweh. Oh, the joys of those who delight in the law of Yahweh. They are like trees planted along the riverbank. Those who hope in Yahweh will renew their strength. Oh, the joys of those who trust Yahweh. Be joyful in hope, patient in affliction, and faithful in prayer. So... Definitely pray about your connections and who you end up connecting to because somebody want to try to like put it off like it's something that is not. This person just really just want to hurt you at the end of the day. They need that supply from you. So I hope you all got a message from this read that will help you along your journey. Know that Yahweh loves you. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you all later. Peace.